Hey everyone, Attorney Bobby Buchanan. This is Illinois Divorce TV. Today we're talking about how to win your spouse back if they file for divorce against you. <clears throat> I'm gonna cut to the chase. There's only one way to do it. You can't beg them. You can't keep trying to contact them. Let's say that they file this divorce and it's completely out of the blue. You have no idea why they filed it or you didn't think that you you guys were on the cliff and that you were going to fall off so quickly. So you get served with these divorce papers and it's it's just um, it's a complete shock to your system and and you're reeling, you're overwhelmed and you're thinking, how did we get here? What's going on? What are they thinking? I, 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 I want to win them back. And you start reading the petition that was filed and it says, one of the paragraphs says, irreconcilable differences, irretrievable breakdown of the marriage. Efforts at reconciliation have failed and future attempts at reconciliation would be impracticable and not in the best interest of the family. Well, damn, that is a strong statement from your spouse. But how can they say this? You didn't even try. You didn't go to counseling or you didn't get counseling enough time. So what do you do? It's counterintuitive, but the only way to truly save your marriage at this point is to agree to the divorce make the divorce the best part of your marriage you two have been fighting quarreling or there has been a breakdown of trust somehow some other way your spouse doesn't believe that you are a true teammate in this marital in this marriage and the only way to prove them wrong is to give them what they want, is to agree to the divorce, is to make the divorce process simple. And you have to play the long game. If you're gonna be able to reconcile with this person, most likely it's gonna be after the divorce judgment is filed or, or divorce judgment is signed. It's gonna be after your divorce and you two are gonna get remarried again if there's any chance, or you two are at least going to come back together again. You're not going to win your spouse back by trying to convince them of how great you are, convince them that you should keep trying or convince them to explain like they don't, they don't owe you anything at this point. They're done. They've made their decision. They've gone through their emotional journey and they've hired a lawyer and they've filed. So you need to do privately the work required to understand where they're at and to maybe reflect and realize why they did what they did and grow yourself emotionally before there's any chance of you two being able to meet. Because right now, you two are not on the same page. One person emotionally is over here. The other person is over here or over there. And until you can do your own work and be on that same level, there's no chance that they're going to see you as a life partner again. Your greatest act, the, the biggest act of generosity that you can give them at this point is to be the perfect partner in divorce, to not be upset at them, to not take the process out on them, to not act like a child in the process, but rather do it maturely, do it fairly, do it like a, a true teammate would. If you were, the, how would you get divorced if your marriage was functioning on all six cylinders? That's how you should do your divorce. And if you, sh you have to show them, you can't tell them what a great spouse you are. I know it's super counterintuitive and, and I'm basically saying you need to jump off the cliff in order to, to save yourself. And at the top of that cliff, there is nobody but yourself. So if you stay up there, you will be alone and confused. But if you jump off with them or after them, there's a chance that they see you in a, in a different light. And there's a chance that you can possibly rekindle this romance. But there is no chance if you try to convince them to come back to the marriage. It just doesn't work that way. Let me know in the comments. If you have any questions,
concerns or if you want to see some videos on something else and don't forget to subscribe i'll talk to you soon